LG has launched its brightest and fastest OLED TV yet in the shape of the flagship G5 OLED for 2025. And I'm going to tell you 7 things you need to know to help you understand the differences between the new C5, G5, M5 and B5 OLEDs so that you won't make a mistake buying the wrong TV. 1. The LG G5 is said to be 3 times brighter than a conventional OLED when measured on a 10% window, applicable to all screen sizes except the smallest 48-inch and the largest 97-inch models. Yes, for the first time, there will be a 48-inch G-series OLED. Historically, LG Electronics has used its B-series OLED as the reference point for conventional OLED, which typically peaks at around 600 nits at D65 white point. Based on that benchmark, 3 times brighter suggests a peak brightness of approximately 2400 nits for the G5 at an accurate white point, a significant jump from last year's G4 which maxed out at 1500 nits in HDR filmmaker mode. Furthermore, during a pre-CES virtual briefing, a senior LG director revealed that the G5 will be 40% brighter than the G4 in terms of full screen brightness. Since the G4 measured around 220 nits on full field white, it's likely that the G5 will exceed 300 nits full screen in HDR filmmaker mode, resulting in a less restrictive ABL and a more impactful HDR experience. At this point, you may ask, how has LG Electronics achieved such a dramatic boost in both peak and full screen brightness in the span of just one year? The South Korean manufacturer, which is the world's number one OLED TV brand, attributes the improvement to its Brightness Booster Ultimate technology comprising an updated OLED panel architecture alongside light and color boosting algorithm powered by Alpha 11 Gen 2 AI processor. LG Electronics has remained tight-lipped on the intricacies of the OLED panel architecture, but during the pre-CES virtual briefing, we caught a glimpse of a subtle, easy-to-miss graphical illustration on a presentation slide we are unfortunately not allowed to publish due to NDA restrictions, depicting an OLED stack composed of one red, one green and two blue layers. This suggests that the LG G5 is using a new WOLED panel with 4-stack structure as reported by Korean media last year, which not only enhances both white and color luminance, but should also expand the REC 2020 color gamut coverage beyond the mid-70s normally measured on WOLED displays. Although because there are still white subpixels at play, we don't expect it to reach the 90% BT 2020 coverage delivered by QD OLEDs. However, LG Electronics was quick to point out that unlike QD OLED televisions, the G5 was able to maintain inky blacks and color fidelity even in bright conditions up to 500 lux, as certified by respected testing organizations UL and Intertech. Given that the G3 and G4 with MLA or microlens array OLED panels still exhibited marginally elevated blacks when hit by light, these certifications confirmed that the G5 is not using MLA technology at all. For gaming, the LG G5 now supports up to 4K 165Hz VRR, becoming the world's first TV to be AMD FreeSync Premium certified and NVIDIA G-Sync validated at this refresh rate. Again applicable only to the 55, 65, 77, 83 but not the 97 inch G5. Realistically, 165Hz refresh rate is only useful for high-end PC gaming, since even the latest game consoles, such as the Sony PS5 Pro and the Xbox Series X, are kept to a maximum refresh rate of 4K 120Hz. The LG M5 is basically a G5 with wireless connectivity provided by Zero Connect Box, so all sizes except the largest 97-inch version will get the company's Brightness Booster Ultimate technology, although partially owing to the limitations of the Zero Connect Box wireless transmission, maximum refresh rate on the M5 is going to be 4K 144Hz instead of the 4K 165Hz supported by the G5. One rundown from the G5 is the LG C5, featuring a non-MLA OLED panel, Alpha 9 Gen 8 processor, and for the first time on a C-series OLED, 
11.1.2 channel virtual surround sound art mixing that was previously exclusive to the G series. Next, LG has finally updated its Magic Remote to be more compact and ergonomic by removing the number keys, allowing the remote to fit comfortably in your hand, and with just a single swipe of your thumb, you can easily access all the buttons. Here are some new features on LG's revamped AI Magic Remote. The accessibility button provides a quick and easy gateway to the user guide, tips, help menus, and other resources designed to enhance your viewing experience. The Home Hub button replaces the old input button and serves a dual purpose. A regular press takes you straight to the LG Home Hub interface, whereas a long press brings up the inputs menu. LG Electronics has also replaced the dedicated microphone button with an AI button which offers two functions. A simple press activates the AI concierge, offering recommendations based on your viewing habits, preferences, and past activities. A long press, on the other hand, enables AI voice recognition, providing the same intuitive voice control from previous Magic remotes. Despite these updates, the new remote retains several iconic features found on older Magic remotes, including mouse-like pointer functionality and quick access buttons at the bottom. Note that in countries where regulations require number keypads, such as the UK and Italy, LG's 2025 TVs won't ship with the new remote. Instead, these markets will receive last year's design with the mic and input buttons swapped for AI and Home Hub buttons respectively. Talking about AI, LG has fully embraced the trend and introduced a range of innovative AI features on its 2025 TVs, building upon previous capabilities like AI Picture Wizard, AI Super Upscaling, AI Sound Pro, and AI Voice Remastering. AI Voice ID recognizes individual users' voices to automatically switch profiles, personalize search results, and recommend content based on their preferences. AI Sound Wizard is similar to how AI Picture Wizard works, letting users create custom sound profiles by selecting preferred audio styles, for example, catering to bass-heavy or dialogue-focused tuning. LG AI Art lets users create AI-generated artwork, customize photos, and display them on the TV or share them externally. To get started, you will get 100 complimentary credits, enough to generate 100 images. Beyond that, credits will be available for purchase in bundles or via subscription. Details to come later. An enhanced AI search with Large Language Model or LLM and Microsoft Copilot integration is only available in the USA and Korea at launch, but may be expanded to other regions later in the year. AI Chatbot not only provides automated troubleshooting for common TV issues, but also allows users to make real-time picture and sound adjustments via voice commands. Okay, here's a quick breakdown of LG's 2025 OLED TV lineup and how it compares to 2024 models. The LG G5 will feature the brand's brightest next-gen WOLED panel with 4-stack design, the most advanced Alpha 11 Gen 2 AI processor, up to 165Hz refresh rate, as well as the latest WebOS 25 smart TV platform that will continue to receive software upgrades for 5 years until WebOS 29. With Samsung Display's QD OLED panels still expected to max out at 77 inches this year, the 83-inch G5 is set to be the brightest in its size class, while the 48 and the 97-inch G5 misses out on brighter booster ultimate and 165Hz support due to panel hardware constraints. The LG M5 shares most of the G5's specs, but adds a wireless zero-connect box that reduces the refresh rate slightly to 4K 144Hz. Moving to the mid-range, the LG C5 brings improvements like Alpha 9 Gen 8 processor, 11.1.2 channel virtual surround sound art mixing, and WebOS 25 upgradable until WebOS 29. Last but not least, we have the entry-level B5, completing LG's 2025 OLED TV lineup. 
the 77-inch LG Signature OLED T Transparent OLED first showcased at CES 2024 will carry over and become available for purchase in select markets this year. If you are undecided about which LG OLED TV to buy, one place where you can get good advice is at Richard Sounds, a trusted British AV retailer with more than 50 stores in the UK, who provides 6 years warranty on the vast majority of TVs if you join the company's VIP club. You will get the best deals through cheaper VIP exclusive in-store only prices, complimentary gifts or freebies, so go visit your local Richard Sounds store or call Telesales for your next TV purchase. Thanks again for your support. Okay, the prices of LG's 2025 OLED TVs will be announced in due course, with some models starting to become available in spring. But should you buy a newly launched TV or settle for an older model? Well, it just so happens that I've done a video about this very topic, so go watch it here.